Hello everyone, this is Veronica. Welcome to my channel where we like to do more and spend less because, oh no, we do not pay full price. Hello everyone. I uh, just wanted to do a quick video because I found something that's a little, uh, not quite vintage, it's almost vintage, but I just thought it was like a blast from the past. Oops, I almost revealed it there. Um, I found something that I had bought, we, me and the man, bought a long, long time ago that we stopped using, but I think I'm ready to start using it again. So about a week ago, week or so ago, we went to this new bookstore that just opened called book off so they have books um they have a lot of like figurines and like anime things video games records cds dvds movies it's it's a really cool store they sell new things use things buy trade sell what have you so we went there we were looking around and they had a section of music which of course we love love music so we went to go look at the music section and they had a one dollar yes one dollar cd section and i thought what that's crazy that's so cheap because like most people don't even buy cds anymore i guess i don't even remember the last time i bought a cd uh but i was looking through there and i thought oh they're not gonna have anything good it's probably like old music unknown artists probably cds that people want to get rid of so they like donate it or i don't know so i said i'm just gonna take a look so i was looking and looking it was a good size section probably like three shelf like big shelf worth of cds looking looking and then i find one good cd and then i find another good cd and then another and then another and this is like not they had some new music, but this is more older music that I grew up with. And I just started getting, you know, flashbacks and memories of high school and college and growing up. So I bought me a bunch of CDs. And the funny thing is the only CD player I have currently is in my car because my car is old. <laughs> so I thought, oh, cool, I could play CDs in my car. I had, I bought this car used, pre-love, and I had not used the CD player, really. Um, I do have old CDs, but I don't even know where they're at. So I bought some CDs. Uh, you know, 10,000 Maniacs, $1, uh, MTV Unplugged, R.E.M., um, Divinos, and these are all mostly late 80s, 90s, I think a couple early 2000, Alanis Morissette, Jane's Addiction, uh, good old Madonna, and I recently went to see this band, and when I saw it, I was like, oh my god, I need it. The Cure, The Cure, all of these were one dollar, you guys, so, um, you know, CDs are bulky. I don't really want to be rolling them, have them rolling around in the car. So the other day, the man was going through some stuff, looking for who knows what. And he's like, oh, well, look what I found. Oh, wow. Yeah. Can you believe it? He found this. Can you guys see there? Coach. This is from Coach. We bought this at the Coach Outlet. I would say at least 15 to 16, 17 years ago. This is at least 15 years old. It is a leather coach CD holder. You guys, look at all those. There's a couple in there, but we've had this for so long. Back in the day, we used to go to the outlets a lot. And they had a lot of stuff, not just like purses and shoes. They used to have like... CD holders, uh, we bought pill holders, coach pill holders, we bought coach um, frames. We have quite a few coach items that are not necessarily purses or bags. So yeah, the man found this and he said, use it to keep in the car. I thought that was very, very cool. There is, um, can you see there, the coach...
So it doesn't have a lot of branding other than the coach there, but the leather's still nice and new, nice and soft. Um, doesn't have a whole lot of other branding inside of it, just those two. Um, but yeah, you guys, I'm so excited. So I'm gonna put all my $1 CDs in here. So I can play them in the car. And these are just some that we had in there previously, but I was so excited. So now I'm gonna go back to that bookstore and see if I can find more $1 CDs to put in my coach CD holder. Can you guys believe that? Crazy. So that's it. That's my quick little video, just blast from the past. Um, one of these days I'm gonna dig up all the coach stuff that we have accumulated through the years and you guys are going to be like, wow, that's some cool stuff that used to sell at the coach store. So that's it. Hope you enjoyed this video. Just wanted to share a little retro blast from the past. Uh, let me know, do you guys even listen to CDs anymore? I think it's funny because young, younger people, not even millennials like Gen Z, um, they just buy their music. They either stream it or just download it off the internet, which I've done too, but there's just something about a record. We still buy records. We have a record player at home. Um, I don't even know if we have a CD player at home. I think the man does, but it's not like plugged in or anything. So I'm going to be enjoying all my, you know, old CDs in my car. So I wanted to film this in my car. So yeah, that's it. Just wanted to share with you guys. Let me know what you think about this. Um, I think we might have another one. The man said he remembers buying another one with the signature C's on it, which we need to find um, and start using again. So you know what they say, everything old is new again. It's the 20 year, 20 some year cycle of things coming back. So um, yeah, I better go back and buy more of my CDs before the prices go up. So yeah, let me know. Let me know if you still enjoy CDs. Let me know what you think of my coach CD um, holder. And if you uh, haven't subscribed to my channel, go ahead and subscribe. Like I said, we like to do more, spend less, you know, enjoy music and only spend a dollar. So hope you guys enjoyed this video. Give us a thumbs up, subscribe, and we'll see you guys next time. Thanks everyone. Bye, I'm going to go listen to some music.